there guys thanks for tuning into my channel i'm ben this is 180 felix so hunter and we're going to detect the beach but right now i'm walking me dogs having lots of fun they are just found a little rubber frisbee so uh alfalfa's run off with that but uh, yeah i thought i'd just do uh, what dogs do a bit of field walking and i thought i know i'll introduce my next video so here you go this is a beach detect late at night thanks for watching make sure you hit that subscribe button if you're not subscribed already um hit the little bell so you get notified when my videos come out because now and again i do do giveaways in my videos i just don't tell you when so you have to watch to find out let's wrap it up then here's me detecting at night see what i got up to what what Yeah, guys, I'm going to put a torch on. There we go. Right, we're in with the first target tonight, and it's a coin. And I thought it was a penny at first, but it's not. It's uh, well, it is a penny, but not your normal one. It's uh, a Ballywick of Jersey one penny. So yeah, a little bit different. So Ballywick of Jersey one penny to start us off with our night detect. Uh, let's hope the evening improves though. I don't want one, one pennies. We had enough of them on the last dig. All right, let's crack on then. Whoopity woo woos. Started off with the coins. Alright, a nice solid crispy 60 one here guys. So uh, let's have a look and see if uh, oh, is that it? No. Not always easy in the dark, but it's probably uh, aluminium or something. It is guys look. A nasty chunk of aluminium. We don't want that. Let's keep going. Alright, uh, another target guys. Luke's over there having a go as well, detecting with me, but he's not found much. But this is a find he'll like, because he's into his bikes. It's a, a quick release off a bike. Not very interesting, let's carry on. We don't want that, that's uh, what I call tat. Yeah, but we'll plonk it in the bag and we'll keep our fingers crossed and stay positive. What else can we do? Well, Luke's, Luke's in with a target. What you got, Luke? What you got? Oh, I'm going to say 20p or 50p. Oh, it's one of the magic, magic coins. It's right in the middle, mate. Mm. Ooh. What are you saying, Luke? What are you saying, 20p? 20p, I think. <laughs> All right, I'll say 50p then. Oh, I felt, I felt certain. Oh, we've both been duped. What is it? Um, bit of shrapnel. Yeah, certain. Let's say shrapnel. I call all that shrapnel. Yeah. Got a uh, 61 in here on the AT Max. I think it was 61. Let's, uh, let's have a look. Right, how are we out? No, I didn't think we would be. Are oh, we a 20p? Haven't got any gloves on again. What we got here then? Oh, shut that up. Shut the pinpointer up. What's that then? Hmm. Oh, yeah, I'd say that's uh, another bit of shrapnel, guys. It looks though, you can't probably see it on the camera, but there was a bit of gold gilding on that at the bottom. That's made me think twice as to what this is now. Hmm. Yes, not too sure. Anyway, not what I'm after. Let's keep going. Whoop, whoop. Don't know how much you're picking up on the camera, guys. With the little lights we've got on, but let's uh, let's give it a go. Probably just going to be junky aluminium, but I'm sure you can appreciate my efforts. It is out all along, and it was, as suspected, a bit of aluminium. Oh dear. No! Another hole, guys, and another bit of aluminium. Not having very much success at the moment, but we shall carry on. It's, uh, it's not good, guys. It's a bottle top. I'm trying to redeem myself from my last hunt, which was pretty dismal, guys. I only got um, 
about 68p all in total and it looks like I'm heading the same direction but you never know just put a bit of torch on there we go right like that last bit of a uh, shrapnel stuff that I got this is the same number 61 uh, don't copy me and not wear gloves guys always wear gloves stupid if you don't wear gloves I am stupid yes what we got then I can't see a sudden thing oh no guys it's just don't so oh, it's aluminium <laughs> oh. yeah, I just found a, a doggy tennis ball I'll take that home for my alpha alpha right. well, a strange 50 50 something or other I said it's just out okay yeah ah uh. What is that then? No. No way. Guys, that's a penny. I can see the penny design. Look at the state of that. I can bend it. It's a bendy penny. Ah, oh, modern coins are absolutely CRAP. Let's carry on. That's the worst one of that, I think. Alright, next target out, guys, is. Uh, it's a little button, little button, broken button, been here a while. And we have about a 2p I do believe guys, yeah that's a 2p, smash to buggery as usual. Not good, row. Another coin and you guessed it, it's another bloody penny. I've had enough of these, I'm having a cigarette. Ruh. Right, finally with a coin again guys and this time it's an older one because it's uh, it's not falling apart <laughs> uh, I can just make out a very faint Britannia on that guys I don't know if you can see that on the camera but there's definitely a Britannia on there now who's on this side can we see judging by the size I'm gonna say a half penny and you can't really get much else off that guys i'm gonna say a half penny mm. oh just in the right angle you can just about make out a vicky there although i can't see it now i've lost it i bet. do believe we are looking at probably a victoria half penny happy days three decimal on the beach once again let's plunk it in the bag hard work this guys in the dark trying to get the cameras working properly with with the light as well um, and the rain it's just I hope you appreciate my efforts guys if you do thanks ah. whoop, whoop. I reckon we might be with a two pound coin here let's see if we can get that right that would be brilliant wouldn't it two pound coin come on Oh, we got, we got. What the friggin' hell is that? Oh, it's got a spring in there. See a little spring mechanism. Oh, wow, what is that, Luke? Uh, no idea. No, me neither. Looks like a little hat that Rayman would have worn on Mortal Kombat, wouldn't it? <laughs> <laughs> it's not what we're after. Let's carry on. Oh, oh. Um. Have you ever seen so many woodlouse? No, they're not woodlouse, are they? What are they then? Oh, mate, my detector's peeping in my ear. <laughs> what are these then? Sea louse, I suppose. Oh, there's lots of them. Look like woodlouse, but they're not. Look at that beast. What are you? Ew. Ew. Oh, I'm gonna give me a creepy crawlers now. <laughs> gonna be itching all night. All right, gonna make this the last bay, guys, because, uh, well, I'll be honest, nothing's happening. Luke's found a one pound. You found one pound 20 odd? Yep. One pound 20 odd for Luke. Uh, and I've not found bugger all. <laughs> You've seen what I've found. Rusty pennies. Oh, I did find a half penny, though, Luke. 
Victoria half Benny. Cool. Yeah, he doesn't seem very impressed. He wants one. Let's carry on then. Luke's in. Where's shiny go? What you got, Luke? What you got? Oh, oh! The detector's beeping at me. You were uh, on it. Where is the goal? Oh no! Oh, mate, what you got? Damn it! <laughs> Foil. Foiled again. Oh, we're out. Oh, looks round. Roundness. It's, 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 it's a button. Ow! Oh. Hey, it's light again. Hey up there guys, it's uh, day two from what you've just watched. Uh, again, it's the evening. Uh, there's a little bit of light left at the moment, but I've only got about 20 minutes or so and the uh, camera won't pick anything up, I don't think. But uh, I've got me torch with me again. And uh, Luke's here again as well. He's swinging away in the distance. Uh, I'll just quickly show you where I am. I'm down Langard Ball area. The Felix Stoke. Now, past that post there, you can't detect. It's a site of special scientific interest, plus it's also a nature reserve. Uh, so you can't touch anything past that post. But from where this sea wall starts, you can detect the beaches all the way up as far as this wall goes, um, which is all the way in Old Felix though. Um, didn't find anything last night, did I? I guess you saw. But yeah, this is where I'm uh, swinging at the moment, guys. There's Luke in the background. Uh, we've just started, so I ain't gonna jibber jabber because you've already watched me pulling up loads of junk. Let's see if I can redeem myself and um, put up something a little bit better before the end of this video. So fingers crossed. Let's carry on. Don't know how well this is picking up in the camera, but we've got some fishing line here. Pick that up. Can't see any hooks on there. Um, ah. Ooh. Have we got our first target of the evening? Our first find of the evening is a bit of fishing line, some bits and bobs on it, and a boom. Uh, no fishing weight. Hmm. Let's uh, keep going. Well, I've let Luke have a go with the AT Max, and this is his first ever target with it. And it looks like he's still dug in the wrong place. <laughs> Let me stick my needle in there. <laughs> needle. <laughs> got it out, didn't you? Oh, he's oh, out. What's Luke's first target going to be? Well, it's a paintbrush. First target with the AT Max. Oh. Uh. Huh? What? Oh. Oh, there's still hope as yet. Is it a ring? Yeah. Is it a ring? Is it a, is it a bit of foil? Is ah. it, it's a bullet. <laughs> a little bullet. It is. It's a bullet tip. Nice. Lovely. <laughs> Well done, Luke. Your first ever find with the AT Max. <laughs> right, next target out, guys, is a bullet, by the way. Yeah, that's it. Is it? It's a bullet. A bullet casing. The business end is missing, but evidence of the war here on Phoenix Day Beach once again. A bullet casing. Better than a penny, isn't it? Let's carry on. Whoop, whoop. And that spade falling there is exactly showcasing how I felt. Just depleted. What a load of junk. I mean, have a look at the stuff I found. Bugger all. I mean, look at it. That's what you get for two evenings detecting. What a load of junk. The beaches are just really dry for me at the moment, guys. I'm not having a very successful time detecting at the moment, but I will carry on and I will stay positive. But yeah, the best find of the day is probably a tennis ball, guys. Um, I'm not even joking. The um, half penny that I said was a Vicky half penny. I don't know if you can see it there, but you can make out Vicky there. Can you just see her there? 
that's definitely a Victoria, and it looks like a young bunhead Victoria as well. So, yeah, that's um, yeah. Let's scrap that. Actually, let's say this is the best find of the evening. Um, and I don't know, a bullet casing. Luke found a bullet tip, so maybe we can put them together, and uh, yeah, we'll have a bullet. But yeah, but what a load of junk, guys. So there you go. It's just it's just rubbish, guys. I'm not having a lot of success on the beach at the moment. I really not. It's um, yeah, it's hard going. I think there's too many detectorists stealing my beach goodies. Hmm. Yes, I'm blaming you. I'm only joking, guys. It's uh, it's it's a great hobby, and the more people go out and do it, the better. I say. It's just brilliant to get out there, and brilliant to just that that thought of you never know what you're gonna find. You know, it's just just that, that buzz is is enough for me. It's it's just really good. But when you do come home with hardly anything in your bag, you do feel a bit deflated. But we shall stay positive, and we shall carry on. So join me next time, guys, where I go out with the club on a new permission. Um, you'll have to see what I find by tuning into my channel again when that comes out. So if you don't want to miss it, hit that subscribe button, hit that little bell, and then you'll be notified when my next video comes out. Thanks for watching, as always, guys. If you go out swinging, stay safe, good luck, and happy hunting all. Whoop, whoop.